Hello and welcome to Stocks Advisors channel. We are looking for interesting buy opportunities for US based stocks. Today we'll have a look at Amiris Incorporated traded at NASDAQ, ticker name IMRS. Well, IMRS is actually a very interesting stock because since uh, the COVID major depth occurred at 17th of, of March, uh, it's showing constant upwards behavior, so constant recovery and uh, seems like that now a new wave is starting. So to understand why is it so? What's going on? Let's first have a look to general stats for the stock. So uh, we can see that starting from 17th of uh, March, actually, we see recovering waves here. Uh, the wave was uh, reconfirmed then at the trend at the beginning of May. So this is the trend one. We can call it the recovery trend. Then we see there was a faster trend observed, actually, starting at the beginning of May. There was a faster trend and it went like this so actually we can call it trend 2 and the trend 2 then used moving average 20 as a support line by the way here we have three moving averages depicted uh, legends are given on the left it's moving average 20 50 and uh, 200 being red blue and uh, sorry being green blue and red lines correspondingly so here we can see that uh, coming back to the trend starting from the May trend 1 switch to trend 2, the faster trend, and then it was reconfirmed at the beginning of June. And uh, the maximum of trend was observed also like 2nd of June, having uh, RSI in strongly overbought situation above 70. Then uh, the wave uh, started to decline, and we see another forming trend, actually. The trend decelerated, and there is a new trend, trend 3, coming. Uh, decelerated trend, trend 3. So now, then this trend actually started, it was reconfirmed somewhere 23rd of June, and then the last wave of this trend ended 13th of July, and then small upwards, and actually it's now relaxing. So what happened this Friday actually is a uh, cross-junction of two trends, the original trend 1 and the trend 3, the slower trend, Plus, we see moving average 50, the blue line worked also as support. So today we actually had a triple support for this stock. And given this fact, uh, and the fact that moving average 20 is above, it's uh, very probable that actually we are just at the beginning of the new wave that might happen here. Also, if you look at, at RSI index, which is exactly in the middle these days, uh, it's usually uh, in combination with stock which finishing its wave when the stock is so-called 20, 50, 200 stock, when these, its moving averages are aligning like this, and the wave is finishing, it's sitting on support, plus RSI is in the middle, usually it's kind of a bullish indication, indication of the new wave starting. Indeed, if you look here, compare um, RSI with previous waves, the beginning, it was always uh, when the RSI was in the middle, and that's a general case also for other waves. You can see it like earlier waves the same in the middle. Uh, and this uh, reconfirmation of the wave, actually second wave appearance here as well. So this is usually a general, a general behavior for, for trend beginning. Also, if we look at the MACD divergence convergence, we see that uh, it went to downwards wave and now seems like going to pierce upwards the positive line. Uh, which is also quite a uh, positive bullish indication here, meaning that most probably from next week the, another wave will start. And then uh, the question will be, of course, when the wave will end. And you can say it depends on positiveness also. There are several uh, resist lines here. So uh, actually this would be the, the first obvious resist line. Then there is a second resist line. And speaking of... Uh, RSI terms indication this would be the first RSI uh, resist and of course if we go to overbought situation which is above 70 that would be a clear indication that the wave is in its maximum trend and it might stop soon and correct itself back and then the question will be where it will correct will it really correct itself to uh, trend 1 or trend 3 uh, and then it's important to see how the moving average 20 is behaving here it's actually kind of flattening long term without going downwards and the last behavior of moving average 20 is something like this so it's in the last moment it's indicating the positiveness in not only in itself but also its first and second derivatives 
similar happens for moving average 20 so actually they sh uh, 50 actually this should be blue line a uh, green line and the blue line so these two moving averages in the last days they showed this situation with the moving uh, der derivatives also being positive meaning that it starts to grow up with acceleration this is usually indication that moving averages will go up and drug price higher so it might be that we even uh, go through these two red resistance lines uh, depicted here and grow further but this we will see actually as an action for the next week uh, for that moment that's all for MRS very interesting stock to watch and to track uh, curious where the, the, trend, the line will reconfirm itself either trend 3 or trend 1 or maybe we will observe another trend uh, due to, as I said, the situation with moving averages and the derivatives being accelerated. Thank you for watching us, farmers, and do not forget to subscribe to our channel.